Hey everybody, it's Lorenzo Valoria with GamesRadar.com and I'm with... Ryan Kim. And we're checking out the uh, Halo 4 Crimson Map Pack. And uh, looks like Brian's in here trying to own people up. Trying, keyword trying. Yeah, but I don't know, I, I saw you pull off a couple of headshots a couple couple minutes ago, so that's pretty, pretty awesome. Uh, but, uh, trying keyword. Um... All right, so what's uh, what's new with these these maps here, Brian? You, you've been playing for at least a few minutes now, <laughs> so this is kind of. Uh, you know, well, I first... started playing the other day, um, and it seems like when you pick the uh, Crimson DLC map pack mode. It cycles you through just these maps, and then in the map selection mode, you can choose what type of game Kill mode. Uh, when I was playing last night, it seemed like the majority of people are pretty much kind of leaning towards uh, Team Team Slayer. Now that guy had some uh, strategic shielding right there. That's awesome. So, so can you uh, can you put it into the regular map rotation too, or is that? And even an option. Actually, that I'm not sure of just yet. I think it might be just um, game over. Just the uh, DLC map packs for now. Cool. And I'm sure they'll they'll end up rotating in because they have their whole season pass thing instituted. So as they um, come out with uh, some more new map packs, these will probably get uh, merged into the existing map pool. Right. All right, we're just going through all the menus. This is live, so uh, we have our chat at the bottom of the uh, the stream here, so or on the stream page. So if you have any questions or you want to talk to us and and uh, chat with us, just shoot your questions right down at the bottom there, and I'll be able to read it and we can, you know, talk it up. Halo. Yeah. So the last map we just played was Harvest. Um... And these are the three new maps right here. Shatter, Wreckage, and Harvest. Yeah, it looks like there's no beating Slayer right now with nine votes. Yeah. See, I need to, I need to get better poses for my guy. Yeah. I'm just, I'm still the basic. Oh, wow, there's a guy who made the classic. There's some really, really cool armor sets available in Halo 4. Yeah, I've seen a lot of, like, I saw one that looked just like Samus around. It was pretty, pretty sweet. It just seems like you need to spend a lot of time to level up, and it seems like some of these are unlocked through, uh, through certain conditions other than just level also. Infinity right, the challenges. Slayer. Um, what level are you? Uh, this is a brand new account, so I'm only level three. Oh, okay. So we're still noobs, it's all right. Yeah. You know, I haven't really been into Halo full, or Halo the franchise since uh, probably since two, and and I think Halo Four is bringing me back. I, I really like this one. Yeah, I have to agree. I was like the same exact way. I played a bunch of like Halo One, um, but with the other ones, I kind of lost interest a little bit. But this uh, Halo Four has definitely made uh, Halo a lot more fun for me again. Yeah, it kind of it brought it back or brought it up to the uh, the modern age, I guess, of shooters with all the loadouts and stuff. And I, I like it. I, I'm not sure if you know you guys out there in the community whether you like the loadouts or not. But you know, I'm kind of a Call of Duty fan, and I, I like to have my own customized loadouts and I, not having to run around the map and find a weapon all the time. But you know, it, it still has all those elements and stuff. So. I mean, that's the thing, who isn't a Call of Duty fan in today's day and age? I mean, like, even though, I mean, like, it's easy to hate on COD, but... I'll get him. Uh, and this is just a completely different experience from Call of Duty, and it's like, you know, you gotta get those headshots or you won't win, or... You know, everybody's got shields and there's vehicles like that. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that I just hit. got hit with by my awesome. teammate, on top of getting shot by that other guy. So, like, the big point of contention in this map seems to be this crashed ship here, because a lot of people seem like they, they tend to hide in here and, and camp and just uh, snipe outwards. And hey, there's a broken down warthog inside. 
This looks like a medium sized map. Is there a, a, a larger size or smaller one uh, as well? Or this is actually much bigger on the outside of the ring. Okay. Uh, I mean, we can actually kind of walk around here. Um, there's somebody behind me. Uh, but yeah, I mean, like, you can. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I totally wasn't looking. Um, but way out here on the outside, I mean, there's plenty of places to hide and, and snipe throughout here. Um, and then there are some uh, weapon spawns up here on these outer platforms. Sweet. So I'm yep. like totally ignoring everything that goes on. Um, so there's a lot to do on the perimeter of the map, but it always seems like people end up focusing on that center building there. Yeah, it doesn't look like there's too many people in hoop. What's that? Oh, it's just a guy. Yeah, for those who are just joining us right now, we are playing Halo 4, obviously, and it's this, this is the uh, Crimson Map Pack, the three new maps that are out now. And Ryan just got owned. But, yeah. As I was trying to flee. We are also live, so if you want to chat with us, shoot something into the chat and we'll be able to read it. Answer yeah, your questions, questions, whatever. Um. If you're not sure whether you want to buy this or not, uh, we could give you some insight into that. Yes. Hopefully. I think Brian can. <laughs> or at least show you how to die. Yeah. You could watch us play and decide whether you could do better or not, and, uh... If you want to play with us, too, we are playing on, uh, GR Video No Spaces. GR uh, Video No Spaces. It seems like sniper rifles, and it seems like there's a lot of people focus on long-range weapons. I love that gun. Yeah, the new weapons in this game seem to uh, really add a lot more diversity, because the, the Covenant weapons got a little boring, in my opinion. Yeah, actually, well, back in the old games, I didn't really like the Covenant weapons, but in this one, I'm kind of gravitating towards them a little bit more. I don't know why. Maybe it's just the, the retro feel of them, but... I also like the uh, Promethean weapons, too. They're pretty awesome. Get out. <laughs> reverse, reverse. <laughs> Actually, we can kind of explore the map a little bit better this way. Um... I mean, that's the thing. I mean, it, it is a pretty decent sized map, but like the out, the outer skirts of the map seem to be uh, pretty dead. That's yeah, I'd say this is probably a, a medium sized map, right? Uh, that place medium large. To, uh, oh, that guy got him. Bad place to break down. All right, we got a couple of questions. Uh, so what do you think about the map pack so far? How, how do you like the, the new maps? And uh, There's also some achievements. You probably haven't gotten too far into it since you're only level, yeah, level four. I think it was uh, it's 250 points for your Xbox Live account that you can unlock up to. Yeah. Uh, so the, there's a bunch to do there. Um, I mean, there's... I mean, there's nothing bad you could say about new maps in, in any FPS game because uh, it helps add more di diversity, especially if you put in a ton of hours um, into it. So definitely it's uh, adding more diversity. I would say it's like a no-brainer. Um, so if you're already playing Halo, you should just get this. Yeah. Um, 
Either that or, you know, if you know you're going to play it for a while, just get the season pass, which uh, I'm pretty sure includes all the uh, upcoming maps, kind of similar to how COD did Elite last year. And uh, we also have a question about the balancing in Halo 4. What do you think of it so far? The balancing? Uh, uh, like the weapons and... I guess the loadouts and stuff. I, I really haven't had any problems with it. I, I'm pretty low level still, and uh, I've been going up against, you know, the, the higher level dudes and not really having a problem owning a bunch of them, so. Yeah, I mean, like, in terms of balance in that regard, um, I mean, I still feel like it's easy enough to, I mean, like, even if you start off at level one, you can still kind of hang with other people who have other abilities, but then there are some, like, things that do feel, uh, like, a, a little cheap that, because you don't have access to in the beginning, like, um, you see a lot of guys with, uh, with jetpacks just kind of shoot over you, I mean, like, I guess if you're new to the franchise, um, getting used to the, the different abilities that are out there. Cloaking, jetpack, to name a few. Yeah. Well, on the default loadouts, they, they give you a sneak peek into a few of those abilities too, so you're not completely, you know, disadvantaged the entire time, so. Like, over, overall, I haven't really had too many problems yeah. with balance. And fighting those things <laughs> is yeah. definitely not fun. And you, you could always jump into one of those, too, even if you're level one, so. Or just run. Oh! No. <laughs> For those of you just starting to watch, we're playing Halo 4, the Crimson Mat Pack. Yeah, there's a, a, it seems like the first person to get that mech generally ends up staying on top for a while. Um, there are, I mean, there's, that was a bad place to go. Um, but there's a bunch of vehicles on this map, uh, but it seems like whoever Whoever gets vehicle uh, superiority first kind of gets the advantage. Right. Oh, nice. That's how you do it, folks. Pull out the Magnum. Yeah. I don't even think I got that kill. Nah. Or even an assist. <laughs> This guy stole my kill. Punch him. Oh, here's the jetpack you're talking about. Yeah. Oh, nice. Um. Yeah, so if anybody has any questions, feel free to ask. We are live playing right now. And if you want to play with us, we're on uh, GR Video. GR Video. No spaces, all one word. We could hop on. Uh, We'll accept your game invite for the next 45 minutes or so. Maybe longer if you guys want to play some more. Um, yeah, the one big thing, like, uh, you know, personally, I'm a big fan of COD, so not having iron sights is kind of getting... you got to kind of get used to it for a little bit. Yeah, I had, um, a, I had a problem with that, too. <laughs> I, was, I was trying to uh, do iron sights, and I kept on throwing grenades. Yeah. But it ended up being, you know, to my advantage a few times because I was... Everybody would be close, and I'd be tossing grenades, and happened that they were being right, they were right there. I mean, as you can see, it seems like the building is a big point of contention here. There's a lot of good. I think there's some stuff that spawns up right in that back area. Now, which map is this? I, I actually missed that. Uh, Not exactly sure. Can we get... Is there... On Sh Shatter. It's on Shatter. There we go. Okay, I can't 
carrying around a big ass <laughs> chain gun there. BFG. Oh, you should run. I shot it twice and I got a miss. <laughs> Yeah, like even the base weapons were pretty strong, assault rifle or, or sniper rifle. Um, so you could pretty much kill anybody with anything, like even this little pea shooter. Well, back in Halo 1, that pea shooter was the best gun ever. Yeah. Headshots galore. Man, I love that gun. Let's get some people on online playing with us. Come on. Join GR video and we'll play a couple games with you. What's your weapon of choice? Uh, personally, I like the battle rifle, but I did not make a uh, loadout prior to starting. So we're kind of restricted here. I mean, you can hear people using battle rifles yeah. all the time. Like, it's just a pretty distinct sound. I think that's been the weapon of choice for a lot of Halo shoot of gamers for the last couple games now. Yeah, it's it's, it's a, super strong. It's pretty accurate. Like a, that three round burst just really owns people. Oh man, they're, so they're all below you. Showing up on the radar. Oh. Feel free to ask us any questions you have. Feel free to add GR video to your Xbox Live friends and join us. Holding it down in sixth place, GR Video, red team. Yeah. You win this. <laughs> so playing with us will basically make you look better by comparison. Because <laughs> we'll be at the bottom of the list boosting everybody else up top. Yeah, come on. We need somebody. Let's get three people in. We'll have a four-man team. be awesome. Can't even level six. Yeah, we did just start on a, a new account, so we don't have too much right now. That's why we're only level five, but not like these guys. Obese goofy. Yeah, it's pretty cool how unique you can make your guy. Yeah, I really uh, haven't seen too many that are exactly the same, except for maybe like the Master Chief ones, or... Like that yeah. guy looks insane. Yeah, very angry looking. So, let's see, we saw Harvest, uh... We saw, we were on saw Shatter. Shatter. Let's see if we can get wreckage in there. If it's like everybody wants to play Shatter. Nobody wants to play King of the Hill? Come on. Well, extraction is kind of cool. Um, it's kind of set up like a, like a sabotage or demolition, where you kind of uh, set up set up this bomb type thing. Now, there's no additional uh, match types or anything in the map pack, right? It's just the three. Yeah, maps. it's just additional. I mean, they just uh, some of the maps are kind of catered towards certain uh, certain modes a little bit more, just to help increase diversity. So my goal of this match is to get fifth place at least. 
Baby steps. <laughs> Baby steps. I right, you got a battle rifle. Let's do it. Extract more targets than your enemy. I think there's a sniper rifle on top of it. There was. Yeah, that guy yeah. got it. <laughs> oh, your team got the walker. Oh, looks like they have something too. Oh, nice. Originally, I didn't think that the sprint would make, you know, it'd be such a big deal, but... Yeah, it's it, kind of it, trivialized, it feels. It's, uh... I think it actually speeds up the game a lot. I feel like I could get places a lot faster. <laughs> because I do. Um, I'm glad they, uh, they made it just a, a regular thing and not a, a perk. Yeah, I mean, like, I feel like it's good, but it's not like it gives you an overwhelming Extracted advantage. Shot. Right. Gain the lead. Well, because everybody has it. Enemy extracted delta. Whoa. Oh, watch it. So if you're just joining us, we're playing Halo 4, the Crimson Mat Pack which is just released and uh we have a live chat going this is live so if you have any questions just shoot us a question in the uh, live chat and we'll be happy to answer it or you can uh join us in game we are playing live so uh just hop on with gr video that's all one word and uh we'll be happy to play with you no one has joined us yet maybe because everybody's at work or at school at the moment but if it's you are at coast. home, oh, East Coast, oh, maybe. If you are at home, come on, let's play. Brian's on the the sticks right now. Enemy extracted elf. Owning it up with the battle rifle. What do you think of the new stuff, Brian? The uh, like ordnance drops and the loadouts and stuff. I know uh, I said I liked it to those. Uh, yeah, Call I mean it definitely adds a little bit of. Oh crap! <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, definitely adds like a new element to to the game, which definitely does make it more interesting. Um, oh. Jesus. Oh. I think he almost had him. Yeah, I put that banshee out my butt. Um, yeah, I mean, it's 
It was weird to see it first, but I mean, you get used to it pretty quick. And... Uh, works pretty well. I like the fact that you can choose from pretty much like a, a, like a static list. Yeah. Alright. We're not sixth place. <laughs> Moving up in the world. Stone Fury says we missed a good chance to sprint up on that thing's back. Oh. I know that's that's the thing. <laughs> the thing I love about the vehicles you jump on anything and kick people out of it. Oh my god. I had a guy do that to me last night. I was in the back of Warthog gunning and then um, he ripped me right out and then he shot my teammate that was driving it with a gun. <laughs> um, so we're gonna do a little switch here. Lorenzo's gonna take the reins and show us what he got. Uh, probably not much, but we'll see. If you wanna join us, GR video, it's right here. G-R-V-I. D E O Clantiger. <laughs> That's G R. <laughs> Do you play inverted? Yeah, you oh, might have to switch that. No, I, I'm inverted too. Oh, thank God. We are two of a kind, birds of a feather here. Yeah, I feel like everybody else here plays normal. I don't know how they play like that. Uh, I don't know. It's it's backwards. Their their minds are just messed up. Was was inverted default and in Goldeneye? Uh, Goldeneye had whack controls, so like it, it didn't even have two sticks, <laughs> so I don't even remember. You had to use those uh, those C buttons. Yeah, because I feel like my preference for inverted started back with Goldeneye. I th I think Nintendo trained me because uh, I think o Ocarina of Time, I'm pretty sure, is inverted by default, and. Uh, you know, all those flying games too, like Pilot Wings and all that stuff. Old school flight sims? Yeah, yeah. X Wing, TIE Fighter, oh, Lucas Arts. Does anybody out there play Inverted? Come on, you gotta join our team. If not, oh, we don't wanna hear from you. <laughs> GR Team Inverted. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I mean, we're mainly showcasing the new maps right now. Uh, ODST 22, um, but they are a measly 800 Microsoft points if you're interested in picking them up. But if you already have it, join GR Video and we'll play some games. That guy looks pretty badass yeah. in the purple. Yeah, this guy's pretty awesome. He's got a skull on his face. Meanwhile, we're lowly level 5 and we're playing with level 80s and 60s. <laughs> That ain't no problem. We'll see what happens here. We'll get him. We'll get him. I think I'll, I'll go with your battle battle rifle load out here. So do you prefer uh, a certain weapon in this, Lorenzo? Uh, you know, I really haven't found my my like go to like. See there, see that grenade throw? That was not, whoops, what's happening? Oh, it's a uh, changing oh. host. Yeah, I kind of freaked out when I first saw this too. Yeah, that grenade toss was not on purpose. I was going for iron sights. <laughs> <laughs> COD has trained you wrong. Oh, uh, I know. But like I said, sometimes it's really good because I don't use my grenades enough. And when I actually accidentally do it, like trying to do iron sights, I, I actually get some kills sometimes, so. Yeah, I mean, another thing that I feel like a bad habit that I carry on from um, from COD is that only having one grenade, oh, whereas in this you get two. Uh, but I feel like Halo is, you know, there, there are certain things that you can take from other games, COD, you know, like host migration and things like that, you know, loadouts, classes to help, you know, make things more interesting. And I think they did a really good job with it. Yeah, totally. 
Well, they had the old school vibe going for it the, for the longest time, you know. You still had to pick up your weapons. You know, you, no sprints, none of that stuff. So, is this game going to go? or? Yeah, sometimes it takes a little while. Halo does love its loading screens, though. Uh, yeah. I noticed that. I still find the uh, the shark and the manta ray a little out of place. <laughs> uh, yeah, if any of you guys are interested, we did just post, uh, uh, was it Shooter of the Year? Yeah, our Shooter of the Year is up today. And uh, a bunch of other shooter-related articles are, are up on the site on our brand new uh, layout, too, so... Which you obviously have seen if you're on here, probably, unless you're on our, our Twitch, but... Yeah, I mean, like, if, e even if whatever you have to say, I mean, if, let us know what you think of the redesign, too. Mm, I'm not sure if we crashed or what. It's still thinking. Still thinking. If, it'll, if it's thinking for another oh. 30 seconds. There we go. All right. Patience is a virtue. Which I don't have in live streams. Yes, we agree, Stone Fury. Replacing drop players is definitely nice because it sucks when you're down. Oh, yeah. Let's find some people. Uh, if you hang over there onto the left, there should be a sniper rifle up on the top if nobody's taken it already. Or you can get that beastly gun. Yeah, I've, I'm horrible at killing people with this thing. <laughs> but we'll see what happens. Are there other people in this game? Come on. Game yes. Victory. Yeah. Winner. Once again, we win. Sharks. First place. We apologize for all these non-gameplay screens here, but we'll get in-game eventually. And if you join GR Video, you could join us in-game as well, so if you've already bought the map pack, that is. Yeah, we won again. We're ranking up close to where I'm at in my personal account, which is kind of sad. <laughs> I think I'm only like level seven or eight. I need to put more time into this game, I think. I mean, it doesn't help that you have to play a ton of other stuff for reviews and whatnot. Oh, I know. The review season has been a little nuts this year, which it is pretty much every year, but, you know, we make do. Look at these guys. Some of these guys look like they're straight out of like Gundam or something. Yeah, a lot of them like remind me of, like robot ninjas. Yeah. I mean, where does that guy even see out of? I don't even see a visor. It's just, you know, it's all, just a helmet cover. All you need to know is he's, he's holding a big knife. Yeah. And he's going to cut you. And I'm sure that knife will penetrate all that armor. Like, look at mine my armor. That's super thick. It's gonna go for the neck. There doesn't seem to be a lot there. I, yeah, I, like it's funny, I often find myself getting distracted by looking at all these cool armor sets and like looking around the, in the menus while the game is setting up. I often find myself forgetting to pick the map I want to play. Yeah, and you, sometimes I want to reset my uh, my loadouts and I forget to go to the Spartan Hub. I like this guy. Looks pretty awesome. Oh wow, the all white looks kind of cool too with yeah. the red visor. Kind of reminds me uh, of Crisis. Yeah. This guy kind of looks like a, a pirate, a teal pirate. Uh, all these guys are. That's a pretty cool face mask. Looks like a skull.
let's do some shooting. Infinity Slayer. Yeah, so if you're just joining us, um, Brian Kim and I'm with Lorenzo Valora, and we're playing Halo 4, uh, the new Crimson map packs. Bum, bum, bum. We just won the last game, so hopefully <laughs> I we can keep that up. That we'll see. It was a little late. Oh no, Lorenzo's in the thick of it. 1v3. Oh! I survived a lot longer than I thought I would, though. Yeah, eat my grenades. Uh. Yeah, what you know about that, Melee? <laughs> I need more grenades. Ah, so close. I was gonna drop and drop on his head. Ah. Damn snipers. What do we got here? What do we got? No, I always think like in the future, wouldn't they? Figure out a better way to reload a shotgun. Like every <laughs> every shooter, it's always the same thing. It's always you know load them in individually. Even in you know two thousand years in the future. Oh yeah, that's the other funny thing about this level. There's that one like stone ramp that you can just like fly off of and launch warthogs or banshees off. <laughs> there, it's right there. Yeah, there's one on each side. <laughs> Let's do it. I think it's time to do some stunts. Oh, out of my way, bro. Bros. Woohoo! See that rotation? <laughs> I need a partner. Or just a victim. <laughs> yeah, I'm not sure I'd want to jump into that the way you were driving it. <laughs> I am lost. Where is everyone? Oh, straight ahead. Oh. Headshots. Oh! oh. Come on! You, you guys saw when that? You should have zagged. I know. That guy didn't even hit. Come on. He had the same idea as you I did. I know. I hate it when people copy me <laughs> and show me up. It's just bodies Somebody everywhere. Oh, cool. This gun reminds me of like Transformers. Oh yeah, totally. The Promethean guns, I'm, I'm pretty sure they're copied directly from the, the movies. 
just kind of like assemble as you pull them out. And like, I feel like that's something like a Decepticon would just pull out of his pocket. Yeah. Uh, which ordinance drop should I choose here? Uh. Request confirmed. Give me some stuff. Yeah, that'd definitely be nice, Stone Fury. Um, them kind of going back and through and, and seeing what's popular and what's not and kind of um, adding maps that way. Um, but it'll it'll definitely be interesting to see how these maps do progress. I'm horrible with these charge guns. Wow. I am sorry, everyone. Don't be disappointed. He's waiting. Yeah. I'm to punch someone. Oh. Haha. <laughs> 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 Got him, sucker. All right, what do we got here? Oh, another one. Game over. Victory. Lorenzo's kicking ass and taking names. Not too bad. Not too bad. Not the greatest, but whatever. A win is a win. Yeah, I feel you guys with the real gun. Uh, it's it's rough. I mean, it definitely looks like it's pretty forgiving, though. I mean, you can just kind of aim around almost like a rocket launcher and still have some success. Yeah, it's one of those jump up in the air and shoot their feet kind of guns. Looks like we just got a bunch of stuff, so let's see what's up. Mm-hmm. Haven't really tried the storm rifle in multiplayer. I mean, do you feel like the uh some of the new weapons are pretty pretty balanced with the old ones? Or what do you think? Uh well you mean the Promethean weapons and yeah. versus the other ones? Yeah, I think so. I don't. I haven't really, you know, played too much with the Promethean weapons, but as far as I can tell, I do just fine using the standard stuff. Like this guy. Look at look at uh, that guy's visor. They want you to go sniper in the chat, Lorenzo. Oh, <laughs> sniper! I oh, know. Don't leave. I don't think we even have a sniper rifle, do we? Mm -mm 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 -mm. Yeah. All right, I'll go find one. Did you play much of the campaign, Lorenzo? Uh, I got about halfway through it. Because Lute is saying that the Needler is pretty OP in the campaign. Hmm. Yeah, the Needler. I always liked that gun. It's always such a, a weird, like, unusual gun. Just load people up with those things and they explode. Yeah, I, I remember always throwing that weapon away in the first <laughs> Halo. Or you just, like, unload it and then chuck it. Oh, well, yeah. It's, it's kind of just a, a toss-away gun for me. Just, you know. Stick it, stick a bunch of them into an elite and run away. Peace. MP40. He kind of looks like something out of like a. Looks, looks like he's going helmet. Yeah, looks like he's going deep sea diving. 
This guy's straight from Gundam. <laughs> this guy... Yeah. I mean, it seems like uh, we've seen the pretty, pretty much all the maps already. And it almost seems like it's guaranteed that most people are going to be going it going to Slayer most of the time. <laughs> yeah. So this guy looks like a Transformer. That's pretty unique. That flat top helmet. Yeah. And it looks like it's going to be King of the Hill on Shatter. One of the new maps. This guy is straight from Call of Duty from the future. <laughs> All right. All right, I'll try to run up and get a, a sniper rifle. He kind of might have to tell me where they're at. Yeah, yeah, Oliver, once we're once we're out of this game, we could show you some of the uh, the armor options in between games. Um, they're all pretty cool. Um, and it seems like half of the, the ones that off the start require you to be a certain level, and some of them uh, require you to do other things to unlock. King of the Hill. Uh, let's do this. New hill available. Control the hill to earn points. Sniper, sniper. Oh, he's going for the rifle too. Oh, there's two of them. Help me. Gain the oh, there we go. Gain the lead. Gain the hill. Gain the hill. Lead. Time to watch my extremely sad sniper skills. I don't watch out for that mech. So Shatter, it's it's pretty pretty symmetrical on both sides. It's like it's split down the middle. Um, Hello, guys. Which I think lends itself to. Oh. <laughs> Double kill. That's right, internet. I just got a <laughs> double kill on a live stream. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> it was awesome. Um, yeah, the symmetrical nature of the map oh. seems to lend itself well to, to various game modes. That and the vehicles help. I got one bullet left. Make it count. One shot, one kill. Come on, guys. New hill available. Oh, it's like right underneath yeah, you. Yeah, I should capture that. Oh, somebody else got it, I think. You have the hill. Nope. Uh, oh, we got it. Oh. Holy moly. And he's dancing. Oh, that's you my guy. He was excited to see you. <laughs> Doing his victory dance a little early. Oh. See if I can make this count. Oh! Oh, there, there I am, just wide out, right out in the open. Right. New hill available. So the chat's asking for you to grab a turret. Grab a turret. And start mowing people down. You can find those in the middle. All right. After oh, you hello. Uh, punch that guy in the face. Oh, ho, ho. Oh. oh. All right, I'll run in the middle. I am taking requests. Whatever you guys want to see me do, I'll do it. For free? See, Maybell knows what's going on. He's following you just because you got that double kill. <laughs> oh, yeah. Available. Oh. You have the hill. Yeah, let's, let's capture this instead. Gain 
I have no idea where the turrets are. He'll take it. Game the hill. Game the hill. It seems like Game the Hill. Game the Hill. Jorge Sosa is reciting poetry to you, Lorenzo. Oh. Something about love. I think it's a little early for that. He's about two months too early. <laughs> I like poetry. I appreciate that. Bromancing? Cool. Oh. I <laughs> love that headshot. Do I get a what's up for that headshot? Anybody? No. <laughs> you just gained two, two new followers. Oh. Come on. See, the the Halo skills, they just they just don't go away. It's like riding a bike. <laughs> An extremely rusty bike. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm all bragging about two kills. Uh, I'm sorry. Shame. I'm helping. Yeah, it seems pretty one-sided right now. You've more than almost, yeah, you more than doubled the score of the other team. Yeah. New hill available. <laughs> I think at this point your team could probably just troll the other one and still win. Oh, oh turret. Let's do this. Uh, that was close. He'll take it. <laughs> We're having a turret battle right now. Okay, I'm gonna change strategy. Who's got the bigger turret? Yeah. I don't know if this guy is still up there or, or what. But there's somebody uh, he's up going there. to the left. New hill available. Oh. Uh, he's got a buddy. Victory. That is how you hold somebody off. Uh, die! I got him. I got him, guys. <laughs> Don't worry. Oh yes, there was a request to go through some of the armors. Oh, okay. Let's in, check uh, that out. In chat a while ago. Got my Spartan points, mobility, shielding. All right. So where are the new ones? This looks new. Yeah, not really digging that whole three-eyed look. Torso. Not bad. And you can see our uh, our Spartan is uh, sporting orange and white. GR colors. Oh, yeah. Shoulders. Other shoulder. Looks like I have to be a Spartan Slayer Master for all these. I don't know if this is new. Is this new? Hmm. 
Well, I think that was it. I think we should be orange and black for the GR colors. Uh, I left black out because there's some black already on the armor. All right. You are forgiven. If anybody has any requests on how I should play this match, uh, let us know in chat. Just we tell are, me. <laughs> yeah, we're we're open to anything. If you want Lorenzo to try and kill people by just punching them, and that includes mechs and banshees and whatnot. But until I get a request, I'm just gonna rocket some fools. Knife. Play it naked. Good thing we don't have a webcam on. Hooked you guys up with the double kill. Play it naked. What does that mean? Yeah, we have to keep things uh, PG-13 here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So and we, also we apologize. Naked is out of the question. <laughs> so can you jump around their spawn and trick them into betraying each other? <laughs> uh... That is I clever. Think, Let's try that. I think the fact that, that we're the wrong color will kind of tip them off. Man, my team is just rocking everyone. <laughs> I'm gonna take this guy's sword. Oh. oh! I lost it. should be dancing around their spawn. I'm, I'm, I'm dropping the ball. <laughs> You're getting distracted there. Oh, I'm sorry. I'll, I'll try not to get distracted. Oh. <laughs> Alright. To the spawn I go. I think the the spawn moves. This isn't this isn't the cool game. Who came up with this? That would be Boulder. We can uh, blame him. Yeah, I'll blame you. So he wants you to follow one around for as long as you can and see how long it takes for him to notice you. Okay. <laughs> it runs this one sneaky ninja. <laughs> How long is that? Like five seconds? Ten seconds? I followed like three guys, so. Next. Your team the Oh. Yeah, so if anybody has any questions about the game, shoot us a comment Your team the ball. in the live chat. Oh, yeah. I kill some of these guys here. Yeah, right now we're just going through and playing some of the new maps that came out with the Crimson Map Pack. Oh. 
Oh, right at the end. I, I didn't carry the, the ball for any amount of time. Yeah, we were too busy trolling around, following people, trying to dance at spawns. We are not team players here at gamesradar.com. So they want you to throw a plasma grenade on yourself and then run in suicide. <laughs> Is that even possible? I guess you could just throw it straight up in the air and have it land back on you. Okay. That seems ridiculous, but not worth trying. Not, not worth trying. Uh, actually, we might have to equip those plasma grenades. Uh. No, the time. Oh, I don't have them op open. They are not available to me. All right, we are getting close to, well, we're a little past uh, the end of the stream time. So this will probably be the last game. So if there's any, any requests or questions that you guys have, just let us know in the chat. Pressing concerns. Shit talk, whatever. I don't care. I'll take it. Capture the flag. Boulder, I have to remind you, this is a PG-13 stream. Yes, please keep it PG-13. There will be no naked streaming. Give me that rocket. Oh, no. Nobody likes a rocket in this game, or what? Capture the flag? <laughs> Maybe? Oh, he totally took it from you. Oh! Enemy flag. <laughs> <laughs> Just bashed everybody. Oh! Oh! -ho -ho! And I don't somehow even know you what ended happened up with the flag. Oh, did you see that awesome kill from a distance? Great. Uh, I think they're going for our flag. Oh. Their whole squad. <laughs> flag defense. Yeah. Hell yeah, flag defense. Through two grenades. Oh my gosh. Everyone's here. Oh. <laughs> oh. Man. That was brutal. some for real though <laughs> when the enemy grabs your flag try to hail Mary the flag holder <laughs> I grab the flag and try to beat someone with it. 
Uh, they just scored too. It's 1 1. Tied. Uh, this is a sad day. Resonant, these maps are 800 Microsoft points. Can I drive while this guy jumps in the car? No? Okay. Should honk. Don't want to work it as a team here. He's just running away. Almost there. Enemy Kill their Protect you, Aja. Oh, get wow. that shield out of here. That guy pulled out a clutch shield. Oh no. Carrying flag. Time to go melee some guys. Oh, yeah, I'd have to say capture the flag is pretty nuts on this board. Yeah. There's so much going on, plus inclusion to vehicles and in such a small area. Oh. Come on now. Yeah, like me some capture the flag. It's pretty awesome. Taking any requests while the stream is still live. Cool. Probably do this one and then we gotta go. Fox of the Desert likes your voice, Lorenzo. Oh, thank you. And they think that you can boost viewers by playing half naked. <laughs> I'm sure. <laughs> That was a pretty impressive kill by the other guy. Yeah, I was flying through the air with the greatest of ease, but... Yeah, that sucked. Oh, what's happening here? They're saying you should use your burst speed more. Okay, there we go. <laughs> First. It's right there. <laughs> I was just pointing at the oh. guy at the time. Oh, burst. Dodge. Oh, see me being a fool. So J Freak asks, what do you think about Halo 4? Me? What do I think? I think it's great. Like I, like I was talking about before, uh, I had played a lot of Halo in the early days of Halo 1 and Halo 2. And I kind of fell off of it a little bit. Oh. But uh, Halo 4 has kind of brought me back. Just with the, the new additions and it's a lot of fun. It's a lot of uh, what I remember it to be. Still need to get through the campaign, but loving multiplayer so far. So it looks like uh, another request or suggestion is singing holiday music while you play. Oh, geez. You don't want to hear my singing voice. 
I can't sing while I'm playing. Whoa. Protect your flag. How about if I get another double kill? I'll sing the Rudolph the Red Nose Reindeer. Rudolph the Red Nose Reindeer. I'm a boss. <laughs> run, run, <laughs> run away from the other team. <laughs> I thought they were facing the opposite direction, so I was gonna go smack them, but. Enemy down. It's four to two. It looks like you guys have this in the bag. What is happening? Boost. Oh. Where did that guy come from? He came from just, behind. He's just hanging out. Oh, nice. Enemy team scores. Oh, defeat. Over. <laughs> Who's grunting? Alrighty. So that was the last game that we had time to play today. Uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed a, a little peek at what, what's available in the new Crimson Map Pack for Halo 4. It's out now, and it was for... 800 Microsoft points. And it comes with uh, some new achievements, gives you 250 additional uh, gamer score, so... Uh, there's a little bit extra bonus there, so uh, thanks everybody for watching. Yes, and thanks for everybody who participated in chat. Alrighty. Even though some of you guys had some weird requests. <laughs> Alright, thanks a lot, and uh, see you next time. Alright, have a good one.